a student has created a portable scalp cooling device for chemotherapy patients. In this story, we tell you how it can empower cancer patients to feel more confident. This is Olivia Humphreys, a 24-year-old Irish designer inspired by her personal experiences. When she was 18, she found out her mother had been diagnosed with breast cancer. Humphreys watched her mother undergo chemotherapy treatments and use scalp cooling machines designed to help prevent hair loss. However, the machines were large, cumbersome and stationary. They required patients to remain plugged into the device during their infusions. I spent a lot of time sitting with her in her infusions and I was able to see the, you know, the operational challenges of running this machine. It's, it's large, it's, it's kind of like two hoovers stacked on top of each other, refrigeration technology, and it requires to be plugged in at all times. So you've got to sit in the corner next to a plug and, you know, if you want to go to the bathroom, you've got to drag a very large machine with you to the, to the bathroom and get into the, into the cubicle and it was difficult. Determined to improve the experience for chemotherapy patients, Humphreys developed Athena for her final year project at the University of Limerick. Athena is a portable and low-cost scalp cooling device. It uses thermoelectric technology instead of traditional refrigeration. Weighing around 3.8 kilograms, it offers chemotherapy patients the freedom to move more easily during the treatment. It's about the size of an A4 page, ever so slightly bigger. Um, tried to make it so that it could be easily put in the footwell of a car if you were coming to and from the hospital and easily carried around. Worst case scenario is that someone would have to carry this to and from the hospital on their own. But in reality, you'd hope that there was someone standing next to you while you were walking to and from the clinic that could help you carry it. But yeah, just trying to make it as lightweight as possible is the key goal because obviously someone that's immunocompromised is going to really struggle with lifting everything. With a battery life of about 3.5 hours, the device can maintain a temperature of 3 to 4 degrees Celsius to help protect hair follicles during chemotherapy. In Ireland, Olivia Humphreys has won a National Design Award for her machine. Athena is still a prototype. It's yet to undergo medical testing. However, Humphreys is collaborating with a medical device startup to take her product to the next level. Her vision is to distribute the device through cancer charities, allowing patients to borrow it for use throughout their treatment.